In the previous segment, we learned how to draw and control interactive plots in R. In this segment, we will learn how to use graphical user interface version of R. It is known as R Commander. To demonstrate this, we will use the default R dataset IDs. In this segment, we will draw various basic R plots using just the menu of R Commander. First, we open R and install R Commander and load it. A new menu will pop up. In the script window, we write the command to load the iris data. Then we submit it. The command goes to output window. Now, click on the dataset menu where it says no active dataset. We can see the iris data listed here. We select it and press OK. The iris data is loaded in the R commander ready to be used. To view the data, press view dataset. In case an edit is necessary, press Edit dataset. Once the data is loaded, choose the graphs menu. Select index plot, choose petal.length variable, select spikes. This will produce an index plot inside R. Also, note that the code for creating this plot is pasted in the output window. Select histogram from the graphs menu. Select a variable, set axis scaling, and a histogram will be produced. Select histogram from the graphs menu. Select variable, and a stem and leaf display will be printed in the output window. To create a box plot, choose box plot from the graphs menu. We can also create quantile comparison plots by choosing the variable and the distribution name. Scatter plot can be created by choosing two variables from the scatter plot window. We can also choose to zitter, put log axis, draw box plots in the margin and insert various lines such as list squares, smooth fit, etc. It is also possible to set the size of the points, access text and access levels. Scatter plot matrix can be drawn by selecting multiple variables. Strip charts can be drawn by selecting a factor as a dependent variable and a continuous variable as independent. In the same way, from the menu, we can also draw bar plots and pie charts. All these graphs can be saved from the graphs menu in various file types as a local file. In summary, we can draw various basic R plots from the R Commander graphs menu. Now, you will be able to use menu instead of command lines to create the basic R plots. In the next segment, we will learn how to draw trees based on clusters.